Good morning, everyone. Uh, today is Wednesday, June 3rd, uh, and I'll be leading you in this day's reflection. Uh, I would like to reflect today on the psalm of the day, Psalm 123. And uh, I'll read just a few uh, portions of it here. To you, O Lord, I lift up my eyes, as the eyes of servants are on the hands of their masters, as the eyes of a maid are on the hands of her mistress, so are our eyes on the Lord. And so we see uh, in this psalm, uh, this image kind of given to us of looking at the Lord, raising our eyes to the Lord, and keeping our focus and our attention on the Lord. And uh, we do that as if servants, as if a servant would be attentive to their master, as if a maid would be attentive to the slightest act of her mistress. It says the, the maid's eyes are on the hands of the mistress. The, sni the slightest movement uh, is noticed and seen, and, um, and we run to the, uh, to the need of, of, the, of our mistress or of our master. And that's how we look at the Lord. You know, when I was a, an altar server back in the day, I think I kind of lived this out uh, before I ever really knew much of the psalm. But I remember when I would serve, I would, I would be very focused on the priest. You know, a lot of could be going on in the pews, a lot of distractions. You know, children could be crying. People could be getting up to, to walk around. Uh, but I would always stay, try to stay focused on the priest, uh, who obviously in, in the liturgy, in the Mass, uh, resembles Jesus Christ and represents Jesus Christ, uh, and in many ways is Jesus Christ for us. And uh, I remember, you know, I'd look at the priest and I would think, you know, if he gives me the slightest look or head nod or uh, gesture, a little, um, you know, uh, action of the of the hand to, to draw me towards himself, uh, I would immediately, you know, get up and, and walk over to the priest in order to help out and assist in any way that I could. And I think this psalm is really a good image for us for the Christian life as a whole and the, and the spiritual life. Um, we sit, we watch, we wait, we listen, and we're attentive. And whenever we are kind of drawn to act, it's then that we get up and, and we act. And But the action that we do is never for ourselves. It's not me, me, me. It's uh, a model of serv service that we see in this psalm, as if a servant were with their master as if a maid were with her mistress. And so in our lives right now, uh, there's a lot going on in the world, a lot going on, especially in the United States right now. And uh, not that it's a distraction in any way or that we should be ignorant to it, uh, but we're, we were reminded in this time to always stay focused on the Lord, to not get drawn into kind of the chaos of, of everything else that's going on, but to be focused on the Lord, on what he asks of us, what he instructs us, and to always be ready to serve, to serve God, uh, especially by serving others, but to always be ready and attentive and waiting and listening to follow God's instruction and to serve him in whatever way he needs us to. And so that's our reflection for the day. May you all have a blessed day. We're still on a, on a roll here, like four or five days in a row of, of pretty great weather. Uh, so I hope you all have a blessed day. And may Almighty God bless you, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen.